Oh, I'm Joseph, of course, the leader for the band, of course, CEO for the company, right here at Edmonton Studio, World of Band Entertainment Studio. So I'll take on downstairs to show you where the magic starts. Okay. We want to continue to be on the top. All right, so my name is Joseph Graham. I'm a musician, a producer, and I'm also a studio engineer for World of Band Entertainment Studio. So we pretty much run an entertainment business. Um, when we say entertainment, we try to cover everything on the entertainment, from booking artists from Jamaica to come here. Um, we also do um, private school, where if local kids want to learn drums, the keyboard, the, the bass guitar, if they want to do that, we have all these teachers already for them. And um, yeah, we also have a rehearsal space, which is downstairs. If an artist want to do like a video shoot for them, as I said, we have the, the back wall. It, just, it used to be a green screen, but we still call it the, the green wall or whatever it is, but the print in the white. And um, persons, if they want to do like a private party, private function, you know, we can end by 12 o'clock, one o'clock the latest. Uh, we also accommodate that as well. You know, and if you want to do a private meeting, we also accommodate that as well. So pretty much that's what we do down here at this, this beautiful basement here. And, um, and we also have a recording professional studio. As people say, when they come here, wow, this studio sounds like Tough Gang Studio in Jamaica. And this is what we always, this, that's the sound we always look for. Because back in Jamaica, we always, we always do our recording at Tough Gang International. So we bring Tough Gang pretty much right here on Eglinton Avenue West. Um, from Kingston, Jamaica. Um, if you know Seaver Gardens, that's where I originally grew from. Yeah, big up to save you. Yeah, you know, that's where I originally grew from. And then I decided to say, hey, guess what? Let's take it to Canada, you know? I have a lot of artists. Mindful, I'm coming here from 2008 with Byron and the Dragoners. Big up to Byron and the Dragoners. I've been coming here since 2008 and touring with the Dragoners. And then after with the Dragoners, the Dragon died. So the band kind of ended up going down a little bit on the bereavement and stuff. So and I said, it's time for me to start my own thing. So this is where World of Band comes in and World of Band started touring Canada. We started getting more shows in Canada. And then, no, oh, this is where we say, guess what? Let's open up a studio here. Well, we have been in business for the past two years. We are still a baby. 2018, 2019, yeah. 2018, opened up, yeah. So it was uh, April 2018, April 1st, right? So we've been in business for two years. So and we are grateful that things are still happening. Why do I stay on Eglinton West? That's a very good question. I can remember the first time I, when we were looking at, when I was looking at a spot pretty much, you know, and as what I mentioned, it's just four of us pretty much in business. Why we choose here? Um, I remember the first time came here, this place was a mess. It wasn't looking like this. Trust me, it wasn't looking like this. It was a mess. And they said, Joseph, so what do you, what do you want to do? You're going to take it? I was like, yeah, let's take it. And then I do my research and I understand this is called Jamaica Strip. And I said, well, from yard to abroad. <laughs> Why not stay here? And, it, and, and um, the, the business, business is really good here in terms of traffic, I must say. You know, people pass in every day, so they're seeing it. So the traffic is really good. So that's the reason why we continue and say, okay, we're going to stay here. And for the past two years, there's no regrettable. I'm not regretting of even moving or anything. Trust me, it's really good. Okay, what I really like about Eglinton was the people, I must say. And just the name alone, Eglinton. And just to hear about the Jamaica stretch, Jamaica city. I was like, I, I think about every day. It's not a coincidence. Because to be honest, this studio should be on Lakeshore Boulevard, right? Lakeshore. And then I got a call right after about to sign a lease agreement on Lakeshore. Hey, you need to come and look at this spot here on Eglinton. Trust me. So I said, well, let's bring back the reggae to the Eglinton strip. And that's what we're doing. Well, to be honest, we want to be a five star, which is we get that five star already within less than a year on Google Map. That's where one of the five stars to the on Eglinton. Yeah, yeah, go. So, you know, we, so growing the business, we want to be the number one, pretty much. We leave Jamaica as the number one band in Jamaica. We will get awards in Jamaica as one of the top reggae band in Jamaica. So, and since we moved to Canada as well, 
for the less than six months, we have six awards already, which show that we're the number one band in Canada as well. Yes. So, um, so we want to continue to be on the top for the studio. We always try to ensure that proper, good mix production leave World of Band Entertainment Studio. So anything you hear go out there, it has to be properly mixed, have to be properly done. I still have persons who come from other studios say, hey, I don't love, love all this song. I know, uh, and then come to us and say, can you make it better for us? I was like, of course. <laughs> but yeah, so this this is our growth, uh, you know, and we're looking to also get, you know, Grammy Awards coming from Mount Eglinton. We're looking, we're working toward that. But we're going to go off for the, um, the Junior Award first. That's we're working off, going off the first from the studio. And it's cool to tell. We can buy the entire building and let's call it the, the, the reggae building, World of Band Entertainment reggae building. Yeah, that's time. So that's the big dream. That's what I look for, pretty much. What do I bring to the community? Okay, so what do you bring to the community? Good vibes, good vibration, naturality, you know, of persons who just, just, just come to the studio, just to pop the door open. It was like, wow, I love this. Uh, this is this is so good for our community we love that you know so we, we always try to bring positive energy you know for even for the youths i have a lot of youths before covid i have some guys who come in from school and they always stop by and i'll just record them for free you understand they never know what's not so we always try to put up, bring positiveness